Hi, meteorologist Michelle Muscatello. We have a really nice first day of March. Sun's back out. It was icy this morning, but things are improving. And this afternoon, we're just going to be watching some clouds rolling in. It's a melting day, though. Temperatures climbing to the lower to middle 40s before a sprinkle or flurry comes in this evening. Tonight, it won't get much cooler than the middle 30s. In fact, rising as some rain moves in later in the night. That'll continue into your Thursday morning. So here's a look at what we're tracking. High pressure overhead keeping us dry right now, but a couple of areas of disturbed weather that we're keeping an eye on to the west of us. You can see those snow showers crossing the Great Lakes. So a sprinkle or a flurry possible this evening. You can see at 2 o'clock those clouds filling in and then that sprinkle or flurry around 6 o'clock in the evening. Any activity early in the night, light and spotty. But watch what happens by dawn tomorrow morning. Some scattered rain moving in for the morning commute. Temperatures upper 30s to lower 40s. It doesn't last all day. Give me a mild afternoon on Thursday. Breezy with a high near 50 degrees. Let's talk about the end of the week system. So storm coming in Friday, looking to be very track dependent here. Initially cold enough for a bit of wintry weather, but then the question is the exact track that it takes. So if it takes this track closer to the coastline, like the computer model I have up is showing, then we'd see a mix or change over to rain or freezing rain pretty quickly at the coastline and a little later further inland. If it stays south, that's a colder scenario for us and could see some accumulating snow. So we'll be keeping you updated on that and its impacts for Friday evening into Saturday. You can get all the details on the main weather page right here on WPRI.com. Have a great day.